Alright, this is going to be a quick explanation and tutorial of the altitude cap uh, glitch in Ace Combat games. Uh, I'm doing this on Ace Combat Zero. It does work in 4 and 5. And I believe also the PS, the PlayStation games, and also the PlayStation 2 remake on the 3DS. I know it works, so that I've tested. Uh, I think it also works in 6, I'm not sure though. Um, essentially what you want to do is uh, head to the altitude cap, which is, in, at least in Ace, it's different on all the games, but in Ace Combat Zero, it's around uh, 3,100 uh, or 31,000 uh, feet. Um, the quickest way to approach uh, 31,000 is at about a 40 to 45 degree angle. Uh, any higher than that, you don't gain as much speed while accelerating, and uh, any lower than that is just, just not necessary to gain the same amount of speed. So anyway, uh, once you get up there, um, you want to uh, always hold the acceleration as best you can, and then you want to level out the best you can around the altitude cap, which is like 31, I think 900 or something like that. So I'm going to approach it, and as I approach it, my aircraft's going to stall because I'm at the cap, and it's going to dip me slightly down. And while I'm dipping slightly down, uh, you're going to accelerate way past the soft cap. Now, um, all aircraft have a soft and hard cap for the, their speed. Uh, yes, I'm, about to, I'm going so fast that I'm about to hit the edge of the map. Uh, so the soft cap is like when you're accelerating normally, you accelerate at a pretty quick speed. And then you hit a speed where you start going very, very slowly, like, you know, one or two uh, miles per hour every second you gain. Uh, that's about the point where... It's like the soft cap, I'll call it. The hard cap is what you gain by doing the altitude stalling cap and can't go past that. So as you see, um, the soft cap for the F4E, which I'm in right now, is like 1100-ish. But by stalling at the uh, altitude cap and accelerating, I can go to like, the am like at 1400, which normally wouldn't be a possible speed to go at. And uh, all aircraft have a uh, different like soft and hard cap for these speeds based on what their speed stat is. So if you were on a faster aircraft, your soft and hard cap would be significantly higher. You'd be able to go a lot faster, obviously. Um, yeah, it's about, like 1490 I'm at right now. We're not going to be able to probably go much faster than this, in this aircraft at least. Um, also, like, you don't want to be way too much of an angle because then you see you, uh, you have to level out and leveling out costs like it just costs like 150 wear. So the best method for doing this is just to ease it in like you know the five zero to five degree range. That way you're pretty much leveled out when you finish stalling and are still going pretty quickly. So yeah, this uh, works pretty much the same in uh, all the Ace Combat games. Uh, it's not useful in every mission because uh, you have to go through in time when it's faster because you have to travel at a 45 degree angle up to the altitude cap. So on some missions where you're only traveling a shorter distance, it's not as useful. Uh, if it's a really long distance, especially in like 4 with going between, uh, like when you're trying to leave the, com the combat zone after you finish the mission, it does save a couple seconds. Um, in Zero, I believe there are two or three missions where it's actually faster when you're actually tra traveling a far enough distance for it to matter, but otherwise just traveling normally at the, the altitude you start at is, uh, is faster.